about the orderly extermination of the global population. We cover that in my seminal film, Endgame, Blueprint for Global Enslavement, free here on the web at YouTube. At least for now, we're being censored more and more. Please get that film, get out to everyone you know. So you've got insects, animal genes, reptile genes being engineered into fish and being released open water. You've got human cross-species clones growing inside of cows so they can harvest the organs. Ladies and gentlemen, they talk about animal rights. What about human rights? They're mixing plant and animal with human. And this will allow cross-species diseases to spread easier into populations. It will give rise to mutant viruses and other uh, mutagenic uh, microorganisms that could create plagues the likes of which this earth has never seen and there are thousands of different laboratories across the world working on these systems we're already seeing clear evidence that genetically engineered crops are what's causing all of these incredible allergies it's what's destroying our immune systems more and more governments are moving to not even let the public know when they're eating gmo food all right, we'll be back with the conclusion of Genetic Armageddon, humanity's greatest threat on the other side. Please spread this video to everyone you know. Great job, Aaron Dykes, producing this. David J. Smith for Newswatch Magazine. Did you know that the United Nations is a Trojan horse to America? They're bent on the destruction of our national sovereignty. And Barack Obama and Hillary Clinton are in league with them. Obama and Clinton filed a grievance against the United States concerning human rights violations. If we accept the United Nations norm for human rights, we'll lose our national sovereignty. They hate Arizona for upholding our laws. They want illegal aliens in this country. We'd like to help you understand why these things are happening by offering you an absolutely free one-year subscription to Newswatch magazine. Just call our toll-free number, 1-800-516-8736. That's 1-800-516-8736. Call now. Are you wondering about your retirement portfolio? Are you confident that the financial advisor is experienced enough to combat climbing interest rates, taxes, and inflation? Stop guessing and go to the expert, Robert Chapman of the International Forecaster. When you subscribe to the International Forecaster, you get Robert Chapman's 45 years of experience and concise investment recommendations. Who needs sugar-coated excuses when you can get the cold hard facts and proven investment leads you can't get anywhere else? For a free introductory copy to Robert Chapman's International Forecaster, Subscribe now at the internationalforecaster.com or call 877-479-8178. Experience the difference. When you subscribe, you can email Robert Chapman directly to obtain investment advice tailored just for you. Don't wait another minute. Subscribe today at the internationalforecaster.com or call 877-479-8178. That's 877-479-8178. Hello, this is Steve Shank. What does freedom mean to you? eFoods Direct is celebrating freedom with the Freedom Food Giveaway. Each week in July, they are giving away a one-year food supply. Just go to eFoodsDirect.com slash Alex and register to win a one-year food supply with a 25-year shelf life. At eFoodsDirect.com slash Alex, look for the new Patriot Pack, a $149 12-day supply of food, plus accessories that is free with a purchase purchase of $235 or more. Call 800-409-5633 or on the web efoodsdirect.com slash Alex and register to win a free one-year supply of food. Then listen to Alex Jones to announce the weekly winners. Also, the first 50 to register each day win a $50 subscription to the Voice of Reason e-newsletter. Go to efoodsdirect.com slash Alex or call 800-409-5633. There's a man named Dr. Wallach who is anything but your typical doctor. Both a veterinarian and naturopathic physician, Doc asks, why does the United States spend more money on health care by far and still rank 50th in health and longevity worldwide? He believes that people should empower themselves with a basic understanding of nutrition, taking charge of their life, and attain optimal health and longevity through nutrition, not by toxic prescription drugs leading to side effects. This is clearly a deadly recipe. 
The good news is Doc Wallach's message is resonating with an increasing number of Americans who are waking up to all the big government and big pharma manipulation of our health care system. I like what Doc Wallach is saying and doing to enlighten people about health care and have joined forces to help this tireless crusader spread his message. Visit InfoWarsTeam.com and listen to Dr. Wallach's Deadly Recipes lecture. It makes a lot of sense, and I want you to join our InfoWars team. Go to InfoWarsTeam.com. That's InfoWarsTeam.com. That genetically engineered crops are what's causing all of these incredible allergies. It's what's destroying our immune systems. More and more governments are moving to not even let the public know when they're eating GMO food. They're coming out with cloned beef, cloned chicken, cloned fish, but not just cloned, cross species. When you read the industry publications of these biotech companies bragging about the part human, part animal creatures they're creating, they say that it was essential from the beginning that they do this so that the clones not have rights. When they mix chimpanzee with a human embryo and play God, they then claim that these poor creatures they've created have no rights. And listen to me carefully here. If this has been going on for 15 years and is now only being introduced to the public, can you imagine what's been going on in secret in government laboratories and private corporate laboratories across the planet? That's why the global engineers are so arrogant. They have been playing God for a long time. They are taking the successes from their research and shelving it under national security for themselves. If humanity survives, when the history of this time is written, our progeny will marvel that we ever survived. And they will marvel at the unmitigated recklessness of the ruling class and what they're doing. The rates of cancers and diabetes have doubled in the last decade. We are being tested upon. This is such a nightmare by these psychopathic technocrats. The same government and corporate institutions that are caught worldwide giving children live polio and syphilis shots. The same people caught funding forced abortions in China. They are engaged in this mad testing in a race for the fountain of youth while they endanger the entire species and the planet in the process. This is the threat, not fake terrorism, not mass shootings, not all of these diversions that they use to sell us on having government take over our lives. The threat is this globalist banking cartel in control of the scientific method and almost all research funds on the planet playing God. This makes nuclear weapons look like child's play. And the psychopathic ruling class is selling all of this as inevitable. You will be assimilated by the Borg, basically. That transhumanism set up by the eugenicist Aldous Huxley is the way to go and that they're just going to do this and it doesn't matter. They have thrown it in our face and we're not even having a debate or a discussion about it. We are being poisoned and manipulated to the food and the water. It is admitted we are under attack. There is a revolution against free humanity through the eugenicist mindset of the globalist. I'm Alex Jones reporting from the front lines of the info war. You have been warned. Now please warn others. Ask yourselves, what are you doing in this time of great challenge? What are you doing to unlock minds? Go to InfoWars.com and PrisonPlanet.tv for the latest headlines and cutting edge information. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are back live and we're going to post an article uh, titled Genetic Armageddon, Humanity's Greatest Threat. And I hope that you will get that YouTube video out and make it go super viral to everyone. We sleep, they live. We are unconscious. Worried about this false habitat, false reality created by the image makers of Britney Spears uh, and Winehouse and O.J. Simpson, LeBron James, uh, Bill Clinton. These are just front people. The scientific elite are in a race to test on us to develop systems for their families, not ours. 
So they're testing systems to dumb us down, to poison us, but in the process developing life extension systems for themselves. I mean, A, that's what the documentation and the history and the facts show 100%. But B, that's also common sense. What would unlimitedly wealthy, powerful people be into? Life extension. And, and, and what is Ray Kurzweil and the whole transcendent man thing doing? He says he doesn't believe in God yet. He's going to be a God. The elite are going to be gods. Well, whether that's anywhere feasible or not, even living, quote, you know, thousands of years like he says they will, the issue is they believe it. And they're selling us the junk end of what they're developing, that, oh, this is inevitable. You will be assimilated. Buy into it. This is the way it is. Just accept it, and you'll be advanced, and you'll be transcendent. When the systems they're rolling out to us are really the antique stuff, the... the uh, the, the the junk they didn't use. And everything we're given has Trojan horses and back doors built into it. I don't know if this species is going to survive. I don't know what our future is if we can't have a real debate about this stuff. If we can't even get the public to understand that this is going on. It's such incredible dehumanization. The rest is up to you. Help spread the word. We're on the march. The empire's on the run. Alex Jones and the GCN Radio Network. Hey, Bill, pick up line three. It's Brian. Hey, Brian, what's up? Brian here. Thanks. Hey, Bill, I just received my shipment of the safety net, our full-year emergency food system. I can't tell you how great it feels to personally not have to worry anymore, especially with the growing threats to our 